Hi everyone and welcome to today's bonus hunt. The eagle-eyed amongst you would have noticed in my 3000 subscriber special won a mission from the list. Now that was entirely my error but Buffalo King Megaways I completely forgot to, to play out. I must have uh, had uh, too much sherry in the uh, in the afternoon. So apologies for that but here it is following immediately on from the excellent bonus on Diamond Mine at the conclusion of that video. Anyway, I've got um, got five scatters here, so hopefully we can get uh, get a reasonable win. And uh, if we get back to uh, to 1,300 on the balance, I'll have, uh, I'll have sort of broken even uh, for the... Uh, for the for the uh, 3,000 subscribers special, so that uh, should be quite remarkable to be honest. So let's see how this pans out. I've got the jacks there at least. Need to get the eagle on the first there. No, so just a pound for that. And again jacks, but I can't see an outshot there. They'll snooker you in uh, certain situations. And again, a couple of duds there. Ah, shame not to get a win there with the multiplier. Uh, missed out on the buffaloes. Goodness me, we're not having much luck on this uh, this particular bonus. Only needs one good round though. So we've still got uh, six spins after this. And another pound. That's better. If we can get the stag on the first, that should be reasonable. No, as it is, it's one pound eighty. Right, a buffalo on the first will be uh, reasonable. Oh yes, landed it, good oh. Just need a multiplier now. No, didn't get the multiplier, what a shame. Anyway, not bad. Uh, we've got the jacks, can we land a wolf? No, no such luck, that's a shame, especially with the multiplier there, that would have amounted to a reasonable win there. And yeah, just the kings at the uh, at the end there. So a total of thirty four pounds thirty pence there. Now it gives a but closing balance of twelve hundred and eighty pounds and fifty four pence there. So in all honesty, being only twenty pounds down there from the uh, thirteen hundred initial start, I've got to be pretty happy with. Uh, with that one, so I can only apologise for missing this one off at the uh, at the time uh, that I initially uh, recorded the um, the video. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the uh, the bonus hunt. So right, let's move on to uh, to today's games. So I've got ten in total here from an initial start balance of seven hundred and fifty, closing balance two fifty. So a cost of of five hundred here, which. Was, uh, we had one major culprit, which was Five Lions Megaways there, but had a really good win on Mystery Museum, which um, uh, you can see on the screen there now. Brilliant in-play win, and uh, yeah, just watch how this uh, how this pans out. So you've got four of the, uh, the wild scatters there, plus you've got a wild on the first reel, and there it's hit a pretty good symbol there. Certainly one of the top ones. And £185 that gave. So that was absolutely marvellous stuff, really. So, yeah, hopefully we can uh, we can capitalise fully on the, on that bit of good fortune there. So reasonable chance of, of getting, uh, getting close to the outlay back on these. I'm going to start this one off today with Invaders. <laughs> Quick 
quick recap as to how it landed. So just the seven free spins here, which you need to get a good start on it really. Great multipliers, but nothing connected. Well, at least we've got a win out of that one, albeit a uh, fairly small sized win. Well, that's a bit better there. That's decent and possible re trigger here. Well, Mega Waves improve all the time off this symbol, so. £10.62. And it looks like I've re triggered it already now. Wow. One pound fifty there for all that. Another wild symbol there. Now how many bonuses are there? Good grief. What a round this is turning into. Well, six extra bonus symbols there. Eh? Marvellous. So, four, we've got 22 spins in total now. Cracky, that really was some round, that. Yeah, it can stop on the alien any time it wants, really. So, times five there. And double wild invaders there, so that'll be worth a few pennies as well. How's that it? Two pounds seventy-nine. Okay. Well, I've got the uh, the doctor there. Can we get another re-trigger? Yes, we can, is the answer. Alright, four extra spins there. And got the invaders. Do they connect, though? Only to the aces. Oh, wow, if we'd got the, uh, the sort of doctor there, it uh, would have been huge. Queens there anyway. And another chance for a re-trigger. Oh, is that connected? No, it isn't. What a shame. Quite an entertaining bonus, this. It's, uh, it's still got a lorry load of spins left as well. I do find it quite exciting when it lands the, uh, the alien in play here. Got invaders there, but don't believe that connects up to anything there. It's a bit of a shame. And likewise for that spin. Yeah, another dud. Thank <laughs> you. 
well, plenty of uh, possibilities here. Three pound seventy two there. And tens need the uh, the alien to turn up again, really. No, it hasn't there. Well, the wild cow there, it's a tiny win there. Three times multiplier. Oh, that connects well. Twenty-two pounds and eight pence. Marvelous. And space rockets convert to jacks. So. This is a fairly enjoyable bonus, sis, must say. And we've got tens there. No, not a single alien in, in sight, sadly. And well, there's no point over there. But again, missed out. So, sort of getting given quite a few dead spins at the end here. Yeah, real shame that it could have been half decent. Right, I've got a chance here though. Not connected, unless it does so here. No, it was asking a lot. And the final spin's a dead one as well, so a bit of a peculiar game this one. The potential there was absolutely off the scale and it never quite uh, quite materialised, sadly. But £75, a decent bonus, that's for sure. It uh, has the possibilities of getting into the hundreds here. If you connect with the uh, alien and also the invader symbols, then it can really go through the roof. But... That's not bad. £75.24. It's taken most of the evening up, admittedly, but uh, £75 it is. Let's just spin this off, make sure it's uh, added it into the bank. Next game is Book of Ra. It's a viewer recommendation. This one, Book of Ra 6, to be precise, so... I'm not too sure. Well, I'm not too sure where my bonus has gone here. <laughs> Often be my nemesis this uh, this game. So anyway, one of the um, subscribers said I should go uh, go down the middle for uh, my choices. So I'm going to try the mystery and see if my luck changes today. Straight down the middle. Oh, for goodness. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Well, yeah, okay. Well, it's probably standard fare, so I can't really, uh, can't really moan at uh, the suggestion too much there. It uh, really do any better, but what a disappointment. I mean, immediately you're looking at a dud, uh, dud bonus here. Uh, what have we got there? Queens. Uh, really not many out shots there, are there? I will persevere with this game and eventually I'll get lucky on it one day but for the regular viewers of the channel it is my absolute nemesis this uh, this game don't know why but there we go on to five lines right on this one I'm going to try the mystery choice today oh dear yeah after the last uh, Last debacle on Temple. I maybe should have just uh, taken one of the uh, one of the standard bonuses rather than risking that. But anyway, here we go. Six spins. Well, that's uh, yeah, that's reasonable. Fifteen eighty-four. Does move along pretty quickly. This uh, this game. It's hard for me to uh, to keep track. But sixteen eighty-six there. Yeah. Just really need one excellent round on this and you'll make the whole bonus so 
8x there, but sadly it didn't connect to any of the premiums that were lurking. One to go. No, no joy there, but £24.03 wasn't too bad, bearing in mind the, uh, the sort of poorness of the mystery there. So, anyway, on to Scruffy Duck now. And I've got to pick a banana here, so let's go for... Hmm... Let's go for the top one there. Mystery... Oh, sorry, symbol removal it is. Symbol removal. So, no idea what this is about. It's the first time I've really played this game, so... I imagine it maybe just removed one of the poorer symbols. Well, that might be reasonable. Yeah, big win it says, so... Counting it up rather slowly, so I don't think it's going to be a whopper, but uh, let's see what it goes. 380... So £8.40 it looks like that was. Yeah, a few snippets there. That's a shame not to get the uh, that sort of duck on the first reel, the sort of uh, orangey type one. Oh, OK, that might be all right. Yeah, we're back in the big win superlative league, so uh, yeah, let's see where this goes. That's a bit more like it. Keep it going, keep it going. Well, that's bump, bumped it up to 36.20, so an excellent round there. Most enjoyable. I actually quite like this game. I think I'll be uh, coming back to this one. Quite like the fact there's variants on the uh, on the mystery uh, mysteries that you can get once you uh, once you get the bonus. So we've got another wild there. Yeah, not much on that one. One hundred. Shame it's not pounds. Anyway, that wasn't too bad at all. Forty-one pounds forty off that uh, off that particular bonus set. So I think I'll have one press for luck on this one. See where we go. No, sadly not. Right, next one. Twelve Trojan Mysteries. It's a new uh, new game. This one. First time I've attempted it. Gave quite a lot of teases before finally uh, finally landing it. I'll be honest, the, the basic gameplay is a little bland, but let's see if the, uh, if the bonus is any better. So, 12 free spins. Uh, mystery meter improves during the uh, spins, so... Oh, I see. It selects one of them there, which presumably... Uh, okay, the horses connect to whatever symbol it lands on. Right, fair enough. Uh, no horses there whatsoever. Uh, right. Well, what is that? A pot of gold? No. Oh, that looks better though. So six of a kind, and that's the top symbol. So that's got to be worth a few shillings. Yeah, big win. Good. That's uh, excellent to see. Well, that's much more like it. How big is the win going to be? That's the question. Not adding it up at a particularly fast speed. So maybe 35, 36 pounds possibly. Mega big win. Right. Okay, it's drawn stumps at 30. Anyway, that was a good round, that. Quite difficult to get the horses to land in the screen on this this particular game. Don't really see many wilds at all, bearing in mind it's supposed to be a bonus, so it might be one of these games where it's difficult to really get an epic uh, epic win off, but who knows? It's uh
And there, not a single horse in sight there. Ah, oh, loads there, but uh, didn't connect, sadly, at all. Not much point putting them on the fourth and fifth reels, really. Well, this is all really rather disappointing, I've got to say. Yeah, congratulations on the big win. So it's one win of £30, and on the remaining 11 presses or whatever it was, it gave 40 pence. So not too sure this is the most exciting game in the world. I'll probably play it on rare occasions, really. But uh, let's uh, let's have a press for luck, and then uh, then we'll move on to... Uh, to another one. So, good graphics, but uh, not particularly good gameplay would be uh, my assessment of that. Next one is Black Gold 2 Megaways. I played this on ATP stake with the uh, super, super stake or whatever it is. So, it basically doubles it. So, it's effectively a 40p doubled to 80. I'm not convinced that it offers value for money doing that. So, I'll probably be a bit hesitant in terms of uh, of playing these uh, much in, in future, but let's see how we get on. We've got a few snippets there. Trouble is you're reliant on an excellent bonus with the uh, with the sort of super spins effectively negating your uh, your starting stake. All very well if it justifies it, but no, nah, it's really not doing an awful lot at all at the moment. Destroyer, right, what's this going to do? Not a lot. Simply uh, destroyed the balance, and that's it. £1.62. Well, what a load of absolute garbage. I might as well gamble that. Let's try the uh, try the diamonds. Oh, good out. Well, 6.48... Right, let's try uh, try doubling up again. I'm going to go for black this time. Oh, shame. It was red. Well, there we go. That's uh, yeah, pretty disappointing. Uh, disappointing game and disappointing bonus off it, really. I don't really like the uh, the fact that you're effectively playing paying double the odds to uh, try and get a bonus. Can't really see the... Uh, the value there, but I might try this game again on uh, just on normal stakes without the uh, without the super stake enhancement. Next one, Beef Lightning. It's quite an enjoyable new game. This big time gaming one, twelve free spins here, but really it's all about getting the double wilds connecting during the bonus, as opposed to the uh, the auction there on the bottom left. It's largely a, a red herring in my view that. Well, not much happening so far, either in wins or in terms of getting the multiplier up for that auction. Well, that's a bit better, plus three there, so if we can get a few cows along the way, then uh, we might get a reasonable end multiplier. Not much happening other than that. Well, there we go, double wilds. So what do they connect to? I think it's just the, the uh, symbols on the first reel. Yeah, that's a shame, that. If you go four ways across, it uh, would have amounted to something reasonable there. And yeah, that's no good either. Well, a bit of a bland bonus, this, sadly never really quite got going and as for getting the trophies up top left I mean uh, yeah there's uh, little or no chance there might as well not be there anyway that's uh, that's it so what do we get six pounds from the auction 1272 very disappointing uh, bonus up right on to mystery museum now this one owes me absolutely nothing with that uh, splendid in play win. That was absolutely marvellous. That I really didn't expect it to be anything like that much. So anyway, this is a poor start here. Can we get any wilds at all? I mean, I said that the game owed me nothing. and That's exactly what it's giving. Um, well, there's one wild. Okay, there's another couple, so that's a bit better. 
we can find one more in the last couple of uh, goes here we might get a reasonable win if it lands any uh, any premiums no there's a bit of a dud there okay that symbol's back that was the one that paid out so handsomely earlier £12.50 for that. Right, can we land another premium? Yeah, same one again. So, well, it'll be another £12.50, won't it, really? £12.50, so total bonus there, £26.45. pence. A bit of an after the... Uh, after the sort of uh, Lord Mayor show, that one uh, there in terms of the bonus, but uh, it can be very volatile. So, anyway, wasn't too bad. Right, final one today is Hippo Pop. I do like these um, these pop games. They're really sort of growing on me, and uh, I think they are they are slightly high risk, but uh, I think the potential is uh, is huge. Right, five free spins, but uh, I'd gambled this up to uh, seven, so hopefully it'll load up okay. Yeah, just missed out on the four there, which would have been good. Well, I say gambled, I free span it up to uh, seven, see it's a no-lose gamble. Right, there we go, so let's see how this seven spins pan out. Hard part is getting the win here. Well, that's good. Uh, hippos, uh, hippos o'clock. Ah, good. Yeah, we've got that connector there. So, we've got a few out shots here. That green symbol, whatever that may be, or the uh, or the sort of horse on the final reel. Well, we've got the green symbol anyway. So, four pounds there. I do like the fact the multiplier goes up every win on this. It gives it absolutely incredible potential. Yeah, that's good to get that. So wins all the way over there. Six pounds sixty. If we find a hippo on the middle reel, uh, we'll be on for a reasonable win. Oh, it's missed everything. That's a shame. Oh, loads of kings there, though. So £4.50, that's got to be 30-odd, hasn't it? Even uh, with my sort of basic maths, I uh, reckon that's about 30. Super big win. There we go. Super mega big win, even. Wow. Superlatives just uh, never stop, do they? Come on, let's have one at the end. Oh, just missed out. All the times twos there on the hippos. But anyway, that was uh, a decent bonus, that one uh, on hippo pop. And uh, yeah, it's certainly one that I'll be incorporating in future bonus hunts. I may well even step it up to the uh, 70p or a or a pound on this uh, this game certainly at 70p i think uh, the the scope there is uh, is huge so 50p is uh, is good fun as well but uh, i think while i'm on a roll with this game i'll uh, might as well up the ante uh, slightly there on this particular one right well that's the uh, that's the conclusion of the bonus sum there total bank of 521.94 so a bit of a, a bit of a hit there on today's bonuses sadly um but i've had such an excellent run lately i was probably due due to have a bit of a loss and um yeah some of those games just never got to, never got firing um beef lightning was very disappointing um as was that 12 trojans uh, 
one which, uh, you know, after the £30 win, I had quite high hopes for that. So, who knows? Um, I'll certainly be giving these games another try at uh, some point soon. And, um, yeah, hopefully we can uh, find a good mix of getting uh, several excellent wins together there. So, thoroughly enjoyable that. And uh, shame it was a loss, but... Uh, as I say, it's been a good profitable month, so uh, I really can't uh, can't grumble too much. I'll be back for another bonus hunt before too long. In the meantime, please do keep the uh, suggestions coming on the channel. They're they're always welcomed, and uh, yeah, happy to uh, to accommodate any uh, any new games where I can. So in the meantime, all the best, and bye for now.